Shirley Temple is a name synonymous with childhood stardom, probably the most iconic child actor there ever was. But when we pivot to her adult life, the scene is quite different. She didn't quite have the same meteoric career as she transitioned into more mature roles. In fact, she only made a handful of movies as an adult. Her adult film career had about five films, a stark contrast to the 20 or so hit films she made as America's Little Darling in the 1930s. Among these, some of the more notable titles include The Bachelor and the Bobby Soxer and That Hoggin Girl, both of which were released when she was in her late teens. As the years rolled on, her presence on the silver screen quivered and waned. What's even more fascinating about Shirley Temple is how she redefined herself after Hollywood. She embarked on a path that led her to become an ambassador, serving in Ghana and later in Czechoslovakia. Her story is a powerful reminder that the limelight of Hollywood can be just one act of an individual's life, not the defining feature. Shirley Temple Black, as she was known in her political career, lived a life that surpassed the glow of her curly-haired, dimpled cheek persona that pirouetted into the hearts of a nation. Her journey reminds us that one can leap from the glitter of a Hollywood set to the gritty reality of global politics and diplomatic endeavors. So, while her time as a box office staple was brief when it came to her grown-up roles, Shirley Temple left a legacy that showcased depth, variety, and the resilience to redefine oneself time and time again. A remarkable feat that far extends the reaches of any movie set. And if I may get personal for a moment, it's this part of her story that I find truly inspiring. Living here in Portland, Oregon, far from the golden glow of Tinseltown, I'm reminded that reinvention is a powerful script we can all write for ourselves. 